New details about a deadly house fire in Long Beach. The body of a woman has been found in the wreckage. Fox 11's Haley Winslow live there with the latest. Haley. Alex and Christine, the next door neighbors just got home and they were really close with her. So they just gave us a lot more information about this woman, 90 years old. Her name was Susie Sakamoto. And they just said such amazing things about her. Up until four years ago, she was doing everything herself. Their cars actually burned in this fire. But they talked about her being in the backyard, climbing ladders until she suffered a stroke. And now this, yesterday evening, they call it a huge tragedy. Her white door charred, windows boarded up, and inside, it's now quiet and dark. After a fire rips through this Long Beach home, killing the elderly woman inside. First, it was just a small fire, and then the wind came, and then an updraft, and then it just got out of control. Smoke billowing up, flames shooting through the roof, neighbors stunned. When I come out, there was smoke coming out of the back, and then flames start shooting out the back end of the house. They watched in horror as police taped off the block and firefighters tackled the fire from the roof, quickly putting it out. But it was too late for the woman inside. Cain Portis lives right across the street. He says her name was Susie, and she had lived in this home in the 2400 block of Fashion Avenue for decades. She was an incredible painter and really close with his grandma. She was actually bound to move soon. Actually really sad. I don't really want to see that picture that she had of my grandmother. She was a nice lady. I just talked to the Long Beach Fire Department and to arson investigators who have not yet released the cause of this fire, but from talking to neighbors for the past hour or two, it definitely does sound just like a tragic accident. Reporting live here in Long Beach, I'm Haley Winslow, Fox 11 News.